This system comes with two thermocouples. Uh, these are very nice thermocouples. They've got a stainless steel overbraid. They've also got stainless probes. Both of them have strain relief, full strain relief on the sensors. And then there's um, actually an exposed tip thermocouple here. Let's see if we can get the camera to focus on this. Uh, these exposed tip thermocouples uh, are made so that the uh, stainless overbraiding is grounded or should be grounded to the car so it's okay if it touches things. It's not going to cause any problems with the sensor. Um, there's an exhaust and an intake. The intake probe is much smaller. Its time constant is very fast. Uh, you'll be able to see things up to uh, about one kilosample per second uh, actually sampling off of this at the maximum. So the sensor is better than actually the sampling rate on the device which is good. The exhaust side has a little bit lower of a time constant but it's still much faster than any available sensor. Uh, keep in mind that the uh, nussle number and everything change when the exhaust is flowing fast around this. This becomes a very fast sensor in the exhaust stream. Uh, it's still exposed tip. It's uh, 310 stainless on the probe. That helps limit carbide uh, precipitate, carbon precipitate in the steel at the temperatures. Uh, this is stainless, strain relief stainless, just like the intake side, the braid is stainless on this as well. They both have um, standard thermocouple connectors. These are rugged connectors and they plug in. So let's plug one of these right into the controller here. Okay, so that's the thermocouple probes. As far as the pressure goes, the pressure zoom in on this. Pressure just connects to hoses. The sensors are actually inside, so they're inside the unit. This comes with pressure sensors. Um, the nice part about that is that all you have to do is put vacuum lines onto this. You can run a piece of vacuum line from uh, your turbo bung where you've got a boost controller, for instance. Um, that's a good place to put it. Uh, the exhaust side uh, the exhaust side, what you want to do is you want to um, break off from the exhaust manifold with a threaded bung and run maybe you know, six inches to a foot of small gauge stainless tubing so that the heat doesn't conduct through that. Then just take it out to a standard silicone hose or something and you can put it into here and get your exhaust pressure. Um, the other thing this comes with is uh, these little stainless bungs so that the sensors fit through those. You just tap an MPT fitting into your uh, intake uh, side and your exhaust manifold and you'll be able to put this thermocouples right in there without having to uh, weld anything.